the 70s online Good morning everybody. We got the Cow Spricks team here. We are going fishing today. We're gonna go for some uh, trout. We got Evan with us, we got Jason with us, and uh, we are gonna do the best we can. It's supposed to be really windy. Anyway, stay tuned guys, and we'll see you at the lake. Before I uh, before I get, over, get you guys over there, I wanna roll a clip. Uh, I went ocean fishing with Uncle Steve a couple weeks ago. I got really sick, so I didn't really make a lot of great content from it, but I did happen to capture a big old lean cod that he caught, so I'm going to roll that for you guys right now. Okay, we're, we're, we're at Ibano now. Oh, yeah. Easy. Oh, boy. That's a big one. Drag him. Got him. Nice. Oh. <laughs> no hoochie. If my house burned down tonight, that's going to be a hoochie. All right, Jordan's hooked. Still on? There we go. Got him. Yep, we got him. All right, only a few minutes in. Come on. Nope, nope, nope. Yep, you got him. There he is. Hey, hey. Thank you, sir. Thanks, man. We'll get right back to you. Alright, there's one. He's actually not a bad size either, dude. That's a good size, right there. Oh, there's another one. 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 Oh, Got off, pulled the bait. Um, crazy windy, making it kind of challenging keeping all our gear <laughs> to the ground and not into the lake. Looking to see if we can get Evan and Jason to fish here before long. Let's go. Just the one. Just the one? Just the one today. Just the one. Just the one. Alright guys, well it's just the one fish today. He's all cleaned up and ready to go. We're gonna do a, I think we're gonna try to do a trout taco with him. The meat's actually pretty uh, pink, pink as orange. That'll be good later on. Alright, well that's gonna wrap it up for us today. Just the one fish. Uh, <laughs> slow day on the lake, but uh, we had fun still hanging out. Uh, there are certainly worse ways to spend the morning, but uh, you guys stay tuned and we'll uh, show you how we're all gonna or how we are gonna cook that trout up later on. Well after a day of fishing we went and picked up uh, quite a bit of meat. Quite a bit of duck meat here. If you guys got a bunch of duck meat in your freezer, you don't know what to do with it, making sausage out of it is the best way to go. It's it tastes really good, you can give it to family and friends, they don't taste any gamey flavor from the duck, and uh, it lasts you a while and it's just more enjoyable for everybody. Now look, there's one right there. See it, Bagundes. 
cooked it up real good. We, we got them done with a mild and spicy sausage. Just want to say a quick shout out, and I apologize if I got your name wrong. I think you. I think I remember your name correctly, and it's Dave. If that's your name, you know who I'm talking about. Uh, I met him today, so it was really cool to meet you, man. Uh, thank you for your support. Don't be afraid to say hi if you ever run into me out there, and uh, it's definitely cool meeting you guys every now and then. So it's nice meeting you, Dave, and I'll see you around maybe some out in the duck marsh. Welcome back, guys, to the final part of this episode. I got the trout here, cleaned it at the lake, and now we're gonna cook it up. We were gonna do tacos earlier, but. You're so tired, we're gonna cook it with what we have at home, so. So right now I'm just scoring the fish. This actually helps it prevent from curling. And it also really helps to get flavor of like the seasonings and the butter and the lemon helps it get all down into the meat to the other side. So now the fish is scored. You can see the marks here. Now I wanna take the butter and just wanna put it on there. You want to take the butter, you want to just rub it into the, the score marks. Alright, and now basically after you get the fish buttered up to your liking, you just want to season it. And we're just going to start with some salt here. Going to sprinkle that on there. So do some pepper. It's a very simple, very simple recipe. Next, we are going to do some garlic salt. And just sprinkle a little bit of that on there. Next, we're going to put some salt on it. This is uh, probably a ingredient most of you haven't seen, it's from Austria. My wife got it when her friend went over there as a gift, so we use it uh, a lot. We actually love it, so we're gonna put some of that on there. All right, and lastly, we're just gonna put the lemon in there on top of the butter. And take the remainders of your lemon. gonna create a little pool at the bottom that's okay because we're gonna wrap this all up in the foil and it's gonna cook all that all these ingredients are gonna cook together all the foil over make sure you pinch those corners really well and so now we go to the grill open up the grill make sure it's nice and hot which it is you just take fish throw it right on there a couple minutes on each side and it will be ready and before you know it In a few minutes, I'm gonna flip it over, get it in one go. Perfect. All right, guys, this is where I'm gonna take the fork and I'm just gonna break it up and just to check the meat here. That looks pretty good there. Now, we're not doing the skin today, so that comes right off. You can see that right there. That meat is cooked and ready to go. Give it a go here. Oh, it's ready. This is the final product of the fish, and uh, I did a little cheat already. I, I tasted it while it was on the barbecue. Just peel back that skin. You can see the meat that is clearly cooked all the way through. Hope there's no bones in here. It's perfect. Tastes of lemon, butter, and the garlic salt, the pepper. Very good. So, quick, easy, simple recipe if you guys got trout. You guys are looking to cook. If you guys like this video, give it a thumbs up. And if you're new to my channel, go ahead and click subscribe and stay tuned for more episodes that are coming. I'm gonna be doing some tip videos on duck hunting and just going over gear that I use. So you guys stay tuned for all that and I'll catch you guys on the next one.